Yeah, bye. How did you put Did you get the job? Did you get the job? Annabelle, why are you firing me with questions? Courtesy demands that when your husband comes home, welcome him, give him a glass of water before questioning him. Oh, water. Let me get it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So how did he go? Did they pick you? I mean, did you get the job? My love, I didn't get the job. Yes. They said they needed someone that has 15 years experience. Huh? Annabelle, what's the meaning of this? Do you know how much I bought this cup? I bought this cup 350 naira. Why did you drop it this way? Okay, Mr. Pano. You have no shame, no shame on your face. What is that 350 naira is your problem? Annabelle, what has come over you? Why are you behaving this way? Because I didn't get the job? Ah! Yeah, it's been over one year since you lost this job. Over one year! I have been the one single handedly taking care of you and our baby. Every day you wear white top, white shirt, white shoe, white shirt. Go out and come out without anything. Clearly to give us a better life. Every day you go out and come out with nothing but stories. Annabelle, I have been taking care of force till I lost my job last year. And you know how that happened. Are you trying to start disrespecting me because I've lost my job? Have I not been taking care of you people? What's the meaning of this now? I'm so young. One year after, you still have nothing to show for it. You know, sometimes I wish you took that money. Excuse me, are you serious? I'm serious. So what about my dignity? Your dignity? Yes. Hold on. What is this? Open it, it's your lunch. <clears throat> Annabelle, what is the meaning of this? Dignity. Eat it. Just in case you don't know, there is no single food in this house. John, I am tired. I have been carrying the burden of this family at my back. My back hurts. John, get a job. Get a job and take care of us in this family. I can't be doing everything. I am tired. Get a job, John. After all, you're a man. Go out there and get a job. What is all this? Every day you wake up and wait. Now, why? John, I said you should get a job. Get a job, John. The 14 million naira we made in February did not reflect in the company's account. Someone diverted it. This also happened in April and October. Sir, we have bad eggs amongst us. They are siphoning the company's money into their personal accounts. If we don't stop them, sir, by December, this company will be bankrupt. Look at it. That's okay. Thank you for bringing this to my notice. I'll get back to you. Thank you, sir. You may leave now. Can I go? I don't worry. Thank you. Thank you for this. Sir, have you lost your mind? Can 
Right, you look. Sorry about that, sir. Sorry for yourself. Thank you, sir. Sir, look at this. This letter says I have been sacked. Yes. That I have been sacked for gross misconduct. Sir, that's not true. I have been working here for the past two years and I have not misbehaved even for once. So where is this coming from? What have I done to deserve this? Mr. Johnson Silver. Sir? You remember the day you came to my office with that file exposing secret things you had no business finding? How can you be so jobless? Huh? We have a thousand and one thing in this office and your foolish idiotic sense told you to open past records and start following it day by day. How foolish of you. Your family must be disappointed in you. Sir, all I did was to report a hist going on under our nose as the branch manager of this office. And this is what I get in return. Mr. Johnson, what were you expecting? A handshake or a word? You see, this is the problem with smart people. They always end up in foolish situations. Mr. Johnson, get in there, pack your belongings, and get out of my office now. Well, I can see you have gotten a well deserved sack letter. Francis, even you. Oh, come on. How could you? I mean, how could you be so foolish? I mean, you could have looked the other way. what I get in return by saying the truth. You did everything wrong. You want to expose this whole branch? Mr. Johnson? Mr. Johnson, there is something so special I like about you. You are very smart. <laughs> You are so intelligent. But hey, if you should agree with me and switch side, I personally will give you a check of 5 million naira and change the contents of this letter to a promotion letter. Trust me. Believe it. My conscience won't let me do that. Please, don't do this to me. <laughs> I don't want anything more than my salary. My wife just put to bed. I need this job more now. So please, don't do this. Mr. Johnson, we are very sorry. It's either you are in or out. Uh, <clears throat> Mr. Johnson, Get out of my office. You are fired. Uh, Jude. This life is tough. This life is tough. See, uh, I just visited my friend John. Oh, God. I thought things were tough for me. Since he lost his job, he cannot feed. His family cannot feed. Then, oh, the way I saw him today, huh? I'm not just happy at all. Uh, so, no, I'm sorry to say this, eh? but see, if truth should be told, you see that your friend, that guy messed up. The guy messed up seriously, and you know what I'm talking about. How do you mean? Okay, was this same guy not living comfortably with his wife? Yes. Okay. Now, just because they offered the same guy. Five million naira without a benefit attached. What did he do? 
he rejected the offer. Mm. Why? Why well, hold on? Simply because he want he, he don't want to be tagged as a bad person. Is that not so? See, 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 see. Let me tell you something about John. John does not like corruption. Mm. Where he was working was filled with corrupt people. He didn't want to be part of that. Does that make him a bad person? Look, he likes living upright. Everybody can be the same. Okay, what are you saying now? This uprightness has kept him where he is now. Yes! What are we saying? You want to be upright, you want to be a nice person, you want everybody to celebrate you as a good person. Where is he today? That's not it, Nas. See, as you should think about how we can help him. Ah, I can help him. That's what matters to me. I don't want to help him. It's perfect. But how we can help him, I don't see where that is coming from. Okay? Where are you going? Annabelle, what has come over you? This is not the Annabelle I used to know. That has not answered my question. I don't care if I'm the Annabelle you used to know or the Annabelle you don't know. Annabelle, watch how you talk to me. Don't forget, I am still the man of the house. Oh dear. Man of the house. What do you have to show for it? Nothing. John, I am tired. I do go fed up. I have been patient enough. You know, some women, they would have packed their things a long time ago and ran off. So they don't die of hunger in your hands. Listen, I am not ready for your tantrums this morning. I have somewhere to go to, so excuse me. Mm. Before you go, just give me one for Julius and like Man of the house, what is the problem? Hmm? Okay, um, Anabel, please lower your voice. Eh? Calm down. Pay them. I, I, I will refund you when I return. Just imagine. I will refund you when I return. Same one you've been using for over one year. John, are you not tired of saying it? Is it not heavy in your mouth? Eh? It has reached what to do as man of the house. You don't know what to do anymore. You can't even do anything. Man of the house. Annabelle. Time for money now. You're talking like baby of the house. I have an appointment to catch up with. Don't make me miss this one, please. Whether you call it appointment or interview, same one you've been going and come back without results. Eh? What makes you think this one will make a difference? Eh? What is this? One thousand naira. <laughs> You're a joker. I know how much Solomon gives you. Annabelle, if I give you all the money I have on me, how am I supposed to get to the venue of my interview? Mm. Uh, so in that case, my son and I should starve because of your fruitless interviews. John, you know, as a matter of fact, I think it is high time you stayed back in this house so we can use this money you, you have in your pocket to eat good food at least. No problem. How much is this? No sense. You will still come back without nothing. You're not guard up and down for nothing. I'm here for the interview. Which of the interview? Interview now. The interview that 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 that, that, that was held by eight o'clock a.m. and you're coming by almost ten o'clock a.m. Uh, sorry, my brother. Something happened here. Yeah? That's by the way. Please, can't you help me? I won't take care. Okay. Let me drop my CV with you. You can hand it over to your boss, please. You won't drop your CV to me. 
Thank you very much. So when will I come back? Do you know they take the thing, Sefe? You carry your CV, you they give them to get man. You they give CV to get man. What did get man go, go, do, go do for you? If I carry this this thing now, go give this aboki here, they do see for 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 junction. You don't say the aboki go thank me very well. So you, you can't help me in any way. I want to help you. I be GM to the but now get man, maybe the GM where they give employment. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. You're welcome. Yes, sir? Can I come back tomorrow? Come again. Good afternoon. Please, uh, um, I'm looking for ZN suit. Oh, ZN suit? Yes. Ah, are you the fine? Yes. Then here now. ZN suit. See, eh? Uh, once you go, if this, see this road now, eh? Uh, yes. Just take them straight, they go, they go. Okay. You see? Come on, hey, hey, come on. Hey, hey, hey. So, come on. Cross, 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 cross. Come on, cross, cross, cross. Come on, cross, cross, cross. I have money. I have money. You can take me. Shh. Big, 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 big. Just take my money and I can't. I can't. Don't go. Do that. 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 Do Boss, let me help you. Yeah, let me help you now. I, I, I don't know. Bro, thank you so much. I I can't stop saying thank you. You saved my life. If not for you, these boys would have made away with my 500,000 Naira. I, I don't even know how, where I would have started from. 500,000 Naira. My brother. Huh. Thank you so much. My God, that, that's, that place is a danger zone. I never knew. It's a danger zone. I never knew. My God. My name is Nathan. Okay, I'm John. Huh. Nice to meet you, bro. Thank you very much. Nice to meet you. Thank you very so where were you going to? I thought I was on my way home uh, after a bad day. I'm sorry about that. Thank you very much. It doesn't always work the way we want it. Mm -hmm. So how how did it go? What happened exactly? What's <laughs> the problem? Let me not bore you with my problems. Now tell me, I, we're friends. <laughs> You've really shown me how kind you can be. Who knows, I can be of help to you too. Okay, um, my name is John. I'm an author here. Yeah. With God's grace, we will push you. I have a wife and a son. I lost my job one year ago. And since oh. then, I've not gotten it. Yes, and you know what that means for your family. My wife has been the one taking care of all of us. And trust me, she is first from dead. I'm sorry about that. It's okay. So how have you been surviving over the year? With your wife, your child? Hand to mouth. Hand to mouth. I'm sorry about that. Thank you. So, what, why, why didn't you get a job? Look at my CV. I've been walking around for one year now, but to no appeal. Mm -hmm. They keep saying, okay, we'll get back to you. Oh, we 
experience someone has to deal with experience okay let's see what we can do oh oh oh, oh. all right just take i will text you one story or the other i'm tired you've proven to be a nice person maybe you can drop your cv with me are you serious yes i can i can help you with a job i can help talk to one or two persons i can help you <laughs> Thank you very much, my brother. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you very much. It's all right. It's all right. Thank you very, very much. Ah, what a I, good day. I, Today is not a bad day anymore. <laughs> Today is a good day. I will call you. I okay. will get through it and I will call you. All right. Thank you very much. You saved my life, bro. Mm. How do I ever pay you back now? It's good to be good. I even took risk because I, I you know, I, I just, I, I walked scared. into the room. I was like, ah, should I run? No. Just shout or do something to you know. Yeah, my God. Thank God. Those boys like they, they took me on a ways. Like I, I never expect. I just wanted to know the direction to where I was going to. And God, <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you so much. Ah. Oh. Um. You sure you're okay with this? I'm fine. Okay. Drew, Drew, a hungry man. It's an angry man. <laughs> That's true. I'm happy your mood is brighter right now. Yes, sir. You know, I cannot stop saying thank you for what you did for me today. Really. You know, and if there's anything you want me to do for you, do not hesitate to tell me. Huh? Don't hesitate to ask. Me, I want something more. Okay. Can I, can I pick food for my wife? Your wife? Wow. <laughs> Why not? I, I didn't even know you were a married man. Uh, I'm married. Wow, wow. You're really a kind man. <laughs> not every man will remember their wife, you know. Ha! If you chop your wife, never chop. You never chop now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, waiter. It's okay, they'll get, they'll get, just tell them anything you want. Thank you very much. You've made my day. Hi. He has done for me. He has done for me. My lovely wife. He has done for me what my father cannot do. He has done for me what my mother cannot do. This is for you. Uh, where did you get all this from? I'm not done yet. Though. He has done for me. He has done for me. He has done for me. He has done for me uh, what my father cannot Shibu. do. He has done for me what my mother cannot Shibu. do. He has done. For me. Baby, enjoy. It's a good day. Uh, where did you get all this money from? Don't worry, I will explain later. Mm -mm. Answer me now. Where did you get it from? Baby, I said I will explain later. Don't you trust me? For now, go in and enjoy. Eat your food. I will explain later. John. Hmm? John, mm -hmm. hmm. I hope the police will not come to knock on our door. Police what? If they are not, we will open the door. Clear conscience, fears no accusation. Don't worry, now just go and enjoy your food. I will explain later. Mm -hmm. Trust me, it's a clean money. Mm -hmm. John, Baby. tell me. Where, where, where did you get all this from? I said <laughs> I will explain later. Meanwhile, let's go in first. Don't finish all of my, my own is here. Uh, your own is with chicken, my, mine is hard stocky. So let's go. Yeah. He has done for us. He has done for us. Yeah. Baby, come. He has done for us. He has done for us. Yes. My 
my love. Mm? I hope you enjoyed your food. Where's my husband though? Uh -uh. Did you just call me? Yes, your husband. Starting when? What happened? My husband. Hmm? What are you talking about? Since I lost my job, you've been disrespecting me. You treat me like a piece of rag. At some point, I even thought I've started smelling. Hey. Uh -huh. Don't say that to me. I know that I, I was disrespectful. But it was out of frustration and hunger. You know, a hungry man is an angry man. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't worry, it's okay. I hold no grudge against you. Solo in Parisha. The J boy. The J boy. The J boy. What the apple? So glad, gang. Solo. Everything good. I'm sure you are just excited. What is something there? Solo. The only solo we don't get slow motion. Everything good. No one. Give me anything. Show you how serious I am, man. Eh? Yeah. The perfect waiting when you don't chop. Was your whole job. You mean I'm? For three days. Hey! Look, tell me what you have. Hmm? Let's make your money, not the rush line. I say enjoy. Enjoy a person, I don't know. You're not Big man, not the rush talk. Enjoy a person. Give me anything. Big and damn all. Two plates. The job boy! The job boy! Oh! See, uh, John, you are so lucky. You are very, very lucky to have met such a man. <laughs> so, you know? Hmm. Funny enough, Mr. Nats, now our age mate. Are you serious? Now our age mate, now my young boy now. That's the way I talk about things that are old man. My young boy, but the dude is swimming in money. Hi. He has money if you see car. I if can you imagine. see machine, Baba. I can imagine. I don't meet some guy. I've met some young men like that with cars. Money. Uh, I don't know, no, no, God don't bless your husband. The matter never finished. Mm. He even promised me a job. Are you serious? Job will they pay me well. I said that guy that got sent. Hey man, your life don't change for the better. Your life has changed. Once I remember that guy, the other drink. Give me another energy. The guy is a blessing to my life. Hey, give me last out. He has money. And he's young, simple, but money there. Now leave women. Leave women. What's leave women? Leave, leave women. women. Your destiny. Leave women. Leave women. Now you marry. Now go to go marry. Oh, man, this girl is fine. God. Hello? Uh -oh. Excuse me? S excuse me? Hello? Excuse me? One minute, huh? Why are your voice changing on me? Come down, let me the format. Please, one minute. Huh? Oh, baby. Oh. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> You're so beautiful. Hi. My name is Solomon. Well, my guys call me Solo for short. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Hi, handsome. I'm Augusta. Hmm. That's a nice name. In fact, I think there's something wrong with my eyes. What's that? I can't seem to get them off you. <laughs> nice one, nice one. That one I know. <laughs> um. I wish I could come closer to you right now, but this should work. I like you. I think you're sexy. The kind of man I want in my bed. 
every night. I mean, I could say I'm in love with you right now, but it may come off as a lie. Even I would doubt myself. But what I'm sure of is, I want you. See you naked, sweaty. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm a married man. I'm, I have a wife yes. and a kid. He's married. I'm a single one, yeah. Come to daddy. Huh? Come to daddy. He's a married man. Huh? You like cinema. You like everything. I'm sorry, but you're not my type. Call me when you change your mind. I doubt your wife can spell Coco not while she's writing you. This food is delicious. My hmm. husband, hmm? I cannot remember the last time we had such a meal. I, I promise, more of this will come. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that you no longer call me baby of the house. <laughs> more of this will come. I'm sorry now. And this food now, this food has protein, carbohydrates, sugar and milk. Again. Um, balanced diet. Inside rice. Balanced diet now. <laughs> Full of shop. <laughs> oh, well, well, well. What do I do? Eh? Hey, Are you sure it's going to be alright? You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Just take it to the My husband, you know, be calling me to come down. back. <laughs> The slipper too. It's so high. <laughs> I can't see you. No. You sounded urgent on the phone, no? He's on the temperature. Oh, we need to go to the hospital now. He's sick. Let's take him to the hospital. Yes, please, please. <laughs> no. Okay, I'll see you later, oh. okay? No. What the idea? Lock the door. Oh. I don't want to. Um, Mister, your child is sleeping now. Thank He's going to sleep in the baby's world. Okay. Thank you so much. And you join this. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Yeah. But I'm afraid that's not all. Just come with me to my office. We need to discuss. Excuse me, sir. Only me or you and my wife? No, just you. Only me. Yeah, we need to discuss. Don't worry. You have nothing to be worried about. Okay. Cool. 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 Relax. Come on. the heart, like the doctor said. My poor baby. What are we going to do? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Don't worry, okay? I will go and raise the money for this. Where do we get 525,000 there? 
will try. You stop crying. It's okay. 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 I'm sorry, huh? Let me go and look for the money. I'm coming. Huh? Problem. Big problem. What is really happening? After all said and done, the doctor said he needs surgery. Operation. Surgery? Yes. The doctor said Junior needs surgery. Oh my god. So what are what are your plans? I don't have any. I swear I don't know what to do. But I believe God will see me through. Amen, I'm coming. No problem. Hello? Uh -huh. Mr. Nat. Thank God. Thank Hello? Hello? Please, I want to talk with you on your phone. Give the phone to the owner. I want to talk to Mr. Nat. Hello? Hello? Mr. Nat? Hello? the wrong number of it. Hello? <laughs> Mr. Nat? What's going on? Hello? Please, I want to talk to any of phone. I want to talk to the owner of the phone. Wrong number. No, 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 John, you don't try. You don't try at all. How could you? How could you lose such an important number? Man, I say poverty never tire you. See. Solomon, this is not the right time to apportion blames. What did they bother me now and a junior operation? They say my son needs surgery. I, I know, I know. But as your friend, I must tell you the truth. You lose guard. You lose guard. Okay, how do you raise such a money now? How do you raise such an amount of money? I don't know. But one thing is for sure. My son, Junior, will not die. Amen. I will sell everything I have to make sure my son gets a successful surgery. No, I, I know, I know. The truth must be told. You lose God. 
If it were to be me, that number. Now in your pocket, I go keep up. Onye ma no ye me. Eh? Onye ma no ye me. Let's see what we can do. What can we do? Hey. My watch, my watch, my watch. My watch, my watch, my original watch, my watch. This is The original man, get everything. And the water resistance. Why not? If it's you. See, the original watch. Okay, what is this one? Oh, oh, sorry. Original watch, original watch. Call my get them, call my get them. Original watch, original watch. Call my get them, call my get them. Call my get them, call my get them. Oh, you can buy watch. Original watch. My hey, correct guy, but we'll see. This watch goes with you. The original. I get my concord. I get my concord. This one original. Ah, the original. What are resistance? Are you not the rust? No, good test them. Guarantee ten years. So how much do you say? How much you want to pay? So how much do you say? Huh? 40 kids for this thing. For what now? The original, how much are the seller? You not past 20,000 and you said this fake thing went all rust like you. Oh, the original. I swear the original. Okay, bring that tonight. Okay. 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 I can get out. You don't deserve to see me. I can get out. You don't deserve to see me. I'm not going to see you. 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 My papa is a thief. Your mama is a thief. The whole family members are thieves. Family in Doshi. I'm not going to watch. I'm not going to call you. Buy watch. Buy watch. Buy watch. Original watch. My focus. I get them. My watch, my watch, my watch. My watch, my watch, my watch. My watch, my watch, my watch. Come and get them, come and get them. Go, 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 you don't say that everywhere I go. This one all I have one. See this one I give you that five k. This one who will give you that five k. 
I said, what's the original? The Vagini 59, no color. The original my book comes. I buy this watch. At that time, dollar day for it. This watch in my hand now, like that. Nine thousand. But because I need money. Fifteen thousand. I won't be able to pay for it. But that fifteen thousand. Give me that five. I swear. I buy a watch. I buy a watch. Don't say something happened. Buy watch. Buy watch. Buy watch. Buy watch. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Jerry's sports will fall my hand. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Oh, I'll let you do it. Buy watch, buy watch, buy watch. Buy watch, buy watch, buy watch. I get them, I get them. I go fast, I get them. Buy watch, oh, wow, but we don't have time. We don't have time, don't lose. Buy watch, buy watch, buy watch. Hello? Sorry, Mama, did you know my phone was ringing? <sighs> my husband has gone to look for money. Mama, please. Please, not now. I made my decision and it's my life. Mama, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Please, mommy. Please. Thank you. I was able to raise 55,000 naira. Mama sent 150,000 naira. Are you serious? I don't like collecting money from your mother. Besides, we are still owing her.
Yes, doctor. Are you getting ready for your son's surgery? Yes, doctor. Um, you are supposed to have at least deposited 200,000 naira. Doctor, my husband is going to bring the money today. He has gone already. He has to do so because the surgery won't commence without at least a deposit of 200,000 naira. He will bring it today. Okay, if that's all then, I should be in my office. My brother, how you doing? Rajon. Yeah. Huh? Welcome. Have fun. Mm. I beg, you get sniper. Uh, sniper, dear. What do you want me to do? Nah, cockroach. Cockroach, they disturb me. Uh, so sorry, nah, so make a bit of money. See, I'm like 200. Thank you, Rajon. Bye bye.
It's a John. John. It's a John. It's a John. I was expecting your call. What happened? I lost your CV, but that's why I haven't been able to call you. I was expecting you to call me. What happened? Sorry. I lost your contact. It's okay, boy. What's the problem? Wow. What's happening? My brother, you don't understand. What's winter, you understand? What's the problem? Why are you not taking your call? You can take your call. We have all the data we can ourselves. You won't understand. What is it that I won't understand? As we speak, my, my wife and son are waiting for me. The doctor needs two hundred thousand there for the doctor's And what are you doing here? Where is the hospital? Let us go. Let me take care. I would handle it. Okay. I will handle it. You will handle the deal. You said your son is in an emergency, so I would handle this call. Just take me to the very Very good. Thank you so much for everything you've been doing for my husband and now my son. Thank you so much. My God in heaven will continue to bless you. Amen. Thank you. Um, it's okay. You don't need to thank me. He deserves it. He's a good man. Don't worry, after this whole thing settled down, We'll have a lot of business to discuss. Listen, your new name is God sent. Exactly. God sent you. I can't stop thanking you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, my brother. You also God sent to me now. God used you to help me that day. So, please. Why is now? Sorry, no, sorry. Thank you. So, God bless you. Make him sleep, oh. Hey, my brother, I can't stop thanking you. In fact, you are God sent. Thank you very much. <laughs> you saved our life. It's okay. It's Thank okay. you very it's okay, much. Please. Thank you. It's okay. It's okay. After paying our hospital bills, you still bought us food stuff. <laughs> what manner of man are you? Thank you very much. It's all right, bro. Thank you. Please, it's okay. Let's just thank God that your baby is fine now and recovering. Okay? I I wish I can stay more or stay longer, but uh, I have somewhere to catch up with. Don't forget tomorrow, 10 a.m. Sure, sure, sure. Please, okay? I'm with you 10 a.m. Yeah. Once uh, again, thank you very much. Yeah? Yeah. Let me escort you. Eh, no, 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 no. Your child needs a lot of attention. Just go. Stay. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Trust me. Tomorrow, 10 a.m., okay? I'll deal with you. Yeah. Thank you very Just much. Just take it easy. Uh, God, go. See, God will replenish your pocket. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mm. 
Ebezina, 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 Ebezina. Ewam. Sorry. You won't believe this. I was about taking my life before we met that day. Why? Why would you want to take your life? Because my son was at the hospital and I could not raise money for his surgery. At the same time, I got quick notice from my landlord. I couldn't bear the shame. I felt like a failure. So I decided to end it all. I decided to take my life before I met you. No. Why, why would you want to take your life? Look, I believe that everything that happens in this life has been ordained by God. Trials, tribulations, everything that comes to the way of a man does not mean the end. There is always light at the end of the tunnel. You're right, sir. Yeah. But as at then, I had no one sent to my name. A man with wife and a kid. I don't know. I understand. And just as I was telling you, three weeks ago, I found some potentials in you, which is rare to come across these days. A very good friend of mine, my bosom friend, who is about to relocate to the United States of America, is looking for someone who would be able to manage his businesses and properties in Nigeria here. And he highlighted the fact that this person should be an honest person. And you know, the only person coming to my mind has been you. Hey, he's a miracle walking God. <laughs> he's a miracle walking God. He's the Alpha and the Omega. He's a miracle walking God. Hallelujah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. You're joking, right? I'm very serious. And um, before you start rejoicing, um, let me tell you about the job so you can know whether you want it or not. Yeah. To know if I like it or not. Oga, you see that job? In fact, I am the job. The job is me. <laughs> I am. Eh? I love it. I know. I love it. Okay. Um. This job comes with an accommodation, feeding allowance, and a car. If you're ready, I can take it to my friend so both of you can sit down and have an arrangement when you want to start. You can even start in three months. It's a miracle walking God. <laughs> it's a miracle walking God. He's the Alpha. And the Omega. I know. He's a miracle. Walking God. Hallelujah. Peace. Let's just Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> you see, that's why I like your energy. You, you're very energetic. Please. Let's start going before the man changes his mind. Uh, calm down. Calm Please down. just go. Calm down. He, he, see, he will change his mind. Let's go. Calm down. My brother, can we just go? Forget about it. Let's go first. I am the one who told you about the job. Let's go and see the man. I can't wait. We'll go tomorrow. It's late. I don't take sleep. I... <laughs> let's go now. Please sit down, Mr. John. <laughs> We've not finished yeah, our dream. Walking God. I hope you know. Um... Mr. John. Hey, hey, hey. I don't want to believe this. <laughs> <laughs> Your wedding house.
this is your new house. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> These are the keys. Mm. And the car parked outside is also yours. There you go. This to help you move around in town and from your office to any other location you want to be. It's a miracle walking God. <laughs> it's a miracle walking God. He's the Alpha and Omega. He's a miracle walking God. How can I ever pay you? You don't have to repay me. And if you must repay me, please just do your work diligently. Do not disappoint me, please. I hold you at high esteem, so do not disappoint me. Mr. Lepo, my husband is a noble man. I trust him. He will not disappoint you. Trust me. Once again, thank you very much. No, it's okay. You're more than a friend. Oh. You're more than a friend. You're welcome. Thank You're welcome. Much. Please. Do not hesitate to call me in case you need anything. Okay, I'm just a phone call. Okay, okay I'm not need anything again. Ah. <laughs> Settle me. Don't worry, I'm I fine. Know. As you can see, the house is well furnished already, so you may not need any of your old properties. No, ah. Yeah, I've dashed everything out now. You don't mix poverty with new life. All right. New me, new house, <laughs> new wife. New, no. Okay, Nyal. New wife. <laughs> Did you hear him? Uh, it's okay. Did you hear him? I, I, I will let you something. No, 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 no. I have to be on my way. You know, I'm always in and out, in and out. So just call me if you need anything. I will. Thank you very much. God bless Welcome you. to good life. Yeah, you are the I'll best. Say bye bye to the trenches. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> all right. Much. Thank you all. God bless you for me. Oh, bless you too. Bless you. Bless you too, Mr. Oh. John. <laughs> This house is so beautiful. I still cannot believe we get to sleep and live in this kind of a big house. You can say that again, my love. Me, I'm not sleeping now because I don't want to wake up and find out it's a dream. <laughs> <laughs> my husband, mm? I thought about the same thing. But you see this night, before I sleep, I'm going to hold this pillow to my chest. Okay. So that if it's a dream, mm. you will wake up with this very soft pillow. So this pillow is your problem, eh? Look at this house. You want to hold the pillow. No problem now. Me, I will sleep in my car in that case so that if it is a dream, at least I woke up with the car. <laughs> <laughs> My goodness. Even Junior, our little baby has his own room. I love all thanks to Mr. Nat. Honestly. That young man, in fact, God used him to change our lives. And I will forever be indebted to him. I will not disappoint him. I trust you. I know what you can do. I, I trust you in every ramification. Are you sure? Absolutely. Then come close and prove it to Zadi now. Stop, John. Stop what? Hmm. Please come closer. It's a special night. We're not sleeping. No sleeping tonight. <laughs> <laughs> but it's too early now. What's going too early? We get time. We get manual. Come here, John. <laughs> No sleeping tonight. Oh. All right, I'm sending the proposals. I will go through it and we'll pick it up from there. Come in. Nuts, 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 nuts. Mr. Nuts. Oh my God. You got a fine. <laughs> oh my God. You're yeah, having a complete seat. Congratulations. Thank you very much. You, you, this is lovely. This is really beautiful. All thanks to you. You made this possible. Uh, I. Wow. I'm wow. 
thank you and thank you once again. You know, if I start counting how many times I've had thank you today, it will fool a whole sack of bags. My brother, I will keep saying thank you forever because it's not easy. You changed my life. <laughs> Look at me. Yes. You changed my life, so you deserve all the thank you in the world. I'll keep saying thank you. Once again, thank you and thank you and thank you. <laughs> well, you're not being bad. You know. Look at you now. Eh, walk at the go can walk or say at it. You got that good? You, you know, you're looking all good. You're not looking like a poor man at all. <laughs> <laughs> so um, everybody's fine. Okay, okay. It's lunch time. Let's go do lunch and meet. Okay, okay, that would be nice. Same sports, right? Oh, you just sport, man. Of course. Mr. Nabs. <laughs> Mr. George. Mr. Nabs. I'm proud of you, bro. <laughs> be, be, be proud of you. I want to thank you all. BJ! BJ, man! Oh, bro, you are so not as big change in my life, bro. Oh man, this guy is clean. Look at the interior. Oh, God bless that guy for me. Amen. <sighs> Big G. Hello? Alright, I'm on my way to the office. I'm coming. Big John, you even changed your phone to an iPhone. My hey. brother. Hey. All thanks to Nathan. That what man changed my life. If not for Nathan, eh, I'll be wallowing in abject poverty. The guy finish up. Meanwhile, <coughs> this is for you. Eh? Enjoy that. All oh, this plenty oh. money for me. What are friends for? Hey! Big J! I trust you, I trust you. See here, this calls for celebration. I beg just carry me go. Any near bar, let's go and flex. Uh uh, no, no. Any no. bar. Now nah, nah, you go go flex. Are you getting me? Uh, because me now, they are waiting for me at the office. I have so many pending business to attend to. So you go have fun, but don't drink too much. I will. Well, I to oh, thank you, man. Thank you, thank you. Eh? Thank you. Hey, no, my man, my man. You see I drop you well. Yeah, drop me before. Hey, hey. See, yeah, you see that I'm, my God sent to people do like that. As so. I meet that guy, everything change. Hey. Everywhere, good. everything soft. Hey, congrats, man. Congrats. No free, you know, say you know, but like, you know, free this money on that one hour. No, 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 I go save some, I go flex the rest. Hey. Wakey, wakey. Dad is home. I'm sorry, my love. I had so much to do at work. I'm from my side. I'm sorry about that, okay? I bought you some clothes. And I also bought some toys and um, ice cream for Jimmy. Hope he's still awake. Really? Yes. I hope you will love them. You know what? How? When did you get the time to do all this? I ordered them online and they brought it to my office. Oh. You know what? Okay. I want us to go upstairs while you size all of them. And I'm gonna sit down and watch. Okay. Oh, beautiful shit. <laughs> Thanks, but babe, can we do that tomorrow? No, tonight, please. I'm tired. Tired mm -hmm. of going upstairs. Me, size them. No worry. I'll get that bridge across it. Let's go upstairs. It's 10 p.m. late. Yeah, but we're home, darling. Let's go. Mm. <laughs> I'm not even putting your ice cream in the freeze. <laughs> 
Oh, very generous ice cream. So, very generous. I'm going to go get us. Okay, go ahead. Um, actually, thinking Junior starts school. Are you sure he will be well handled in school? Uh -huh. Sure. I will. I mean, it's high time he started interacting with <laughs> babies of his age. And by that, so I'll have time for myself. Are you sure my son will be safe in that school? Maybe he's going to be safe. All right, dear. Do you have any school in mind? Yes. The one close by. I'll have to just go there and figure out how much they pay, and I'll let you know. All right. Go ahead. Thank you. Welcome. <laughs> All right, um, first thing tomorrow morning, I'll pay in eleven million. Then on Friday, I'll make it up twenty. Mm. Yeah. All right, now call me. What's up? Uncle John. Uh, I'm on a dinner. Fine, sir. Is this up? No. <laughs> of course, I know you people. Uncle John. Uh? We, we used to live in the same street back before. Ah, hey. yes, sir. We stayed in the same street hey, before. Hey, hey. hey uh, how that side now? We fine, sir. We good. All right, um, no one. So, you know, is you guys so should sure? manage this. Eh? Uh, oh, oh, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. No one. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. My regards to your wife, sir. No one. Thank you, sir. Bye, sir. Yeah. This is. Thirty thousand naira, Uncle John. You don't give us thirty thousand naira, Uncle John. The debt that used to owe people money that time back in our in, the, uh, in our streets. This is not ordinary. I think so because how can you make such huge amount of money in less than a year? Is this not ritualism? Yeah. Huh? Exactly. I second that motion. Or is it to this Yahoo Yahoo? Uh -huh. How can you make such amount of money? Well, anyway, I cover this money with the blood of Jesus Christ. I'm going to chop this. Share, share it. I better shift jaw. I better shift. Give you a tea. Am I a mate? Ah, give you a tea. Babe? Mm -hmm. I was gonna tell you something. What's that? I need a nanny. A nanny? What for? I mean, Junior is now in school. Most times she will not. So, what do you need a nanny for? What will the nanny be doing? Who's going to be doing the house chores? <laughs> you just tell me you want someone around as a big man's wife. I don't understand. <laughs> oh, eh? What's wrong with you? Yeah. Hi, my children. How are you? I'm not allowed to enter. 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 I'm not allowed to Hi! Hey. So, will my house find like this? And you know why invite me, your mother? Eh? Oh, yeah. Every time I want to come, you go tell me, wait, 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 wait. Hey! No, Mama, we were planning on how to invite you. Yes. Ha! This one is a big story. Mama. Uh -huh. Honestly, you should have informed us before coming. It's a phone call. Call you. Call Ona. Eh? So, you know, this is no guessing. 
I'm a very darling woman. Eh? Hey. In fact, I'm not there because of the way my son. Where my grandson and I come from. Go wake up. I'm going to carry my bag. Go wake up. I need to carry my grandson. Yes, I come because of him. Um, because of him. Um, no, no, no. I come because of my grandchild. I want to carry my child. I'm going to go with my bono. Bulu, bulu. Hey! Hey! Oh, Goku. I see my grandson. Hey, what? Oh. Um, I have four mini companies under my management. And I just got another contract to manage the finance of a bigger company. And trust me, I can't handle all that. So I want to hand over one company to you. Once you do well, I will give you a Um, I want to be my own boss. I can't keep working for someone else. I want to do something that I have passion for. Listen, Solomon, you have to start somewhere. The pay is good. Raise money from the job and pursue your so-called passion. Oh, no, you don't understand. See, what I need to achieve what I want is more money. It's not what you think. <laughs> but Solomon, you've been telling me this story like three different times. Same story. And I've been giving you money, yet you have nothing to show for it. And you know how it is with us now. You know, it's not easy for a man. Yeah? I get this money from you, small time mama will come with her own issues. This will come, that will, I spend on them. But see this time, eh? if you give me money, I promise you, I will focus on the business and leave family problem aside. Solomon, I have given you over 5 million naira. Yet, you have nothing to show for it. Listen, in as much as I love giving, I don't encourage reckless spending. I'm doing this because you stood by me when I was broke. You were there for me when I was down. So please, you need to put your life together. I know, I know. But this time around will be different. Okay? This time. Uh, hello? Rebecca? Oh, sorry, sorry. Amaka? Uh, which Amaka is this? Slim, sexy Amaka? Baby, you know what? I'm in a meeting now. Huh? Let's meet by 6 p.m. at our usual, okay? All right. I'm me, baby. Yeah, as I was saying, no, huh? you have nothing to say. This is your problem. I'm Maka today, Linda tomorrow, next tomorrow, Philomena. This type of life you are living is slowing your success. Don't you understand? I know, I know. Stick to one woman and build yourself. Uh, let's leave all that. Pastor, leave it. You know what? If you cannot give me the 7 million naira to us, give me instrumental. Give me 3.5 now. Maybe give me 3.5 later on. Mama, which one is cast the band, the fire, fire? I'm going to go to the house. You push your start up, let us pray. We need to fire all the devil, all the enemy of progress in this house. We need to fire them back to armies. Stand up! Stand up! Hey! Raka, mama, 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 mama. This coming, man. My son, this is how you chase your enemy away. They are deaf and dumb. In fact, their enemy are wicked. If you don't shout, they will remain where they are. Fire from the sky. 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 Fire from the sky.
am Hazel. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. I cast. I band. I cast. I band. I lose. I scatter. I scatter. I damage. I damage. Back to others. Back to Goodness. John? Yes, that's my name. <laughs> you obviously don't remember me. <laughs> we met some time ago at a bar. You were with someone, some guy, Solo Solomon or so. I told you I liked you. Oh, 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 oh. now I remember. <laughs> what brings you to my office? I am Augusta Jack. Augusta Jack? Yes, I'm representing Jack and Co. Limited. Are you serious? What a small world. <laughs> So you are the CEO of the new company I'm about to work with? Uh, a bit of that is true. My dad owns the company. And uh, we're hoping to strike a good deal with you. All right then. Straight to business. What is the offer? Um, I'd um, first like to apologize for the other day. Come on, I have no grudge against you. Yes. So what's the offer? Thank you. Um, you know, uh, as you may have heard, right, um, our company's finances have not been looking so, so good. So we're just trying to, you know, we heard about you, you know, as we spoke. And um, I thought to come here and let's, let's talk. About the offer, um, <laughs> you were just... <laughs> <laughs> Going straight to um, offer. What What are your um? Mama, you will soon tell me if my husband married you or he married me. What's all this? Hey, like you can me. What is my offense? Oh, is it because I prepared a delicious meal for my son-in-law? Mama, why are you indirectly trying to make my husband feel that my own food is not delicious? Why? No, it's not what I meant. Oh, it's not what I mean. Uh, but if it is what you think, well, so be it. Eh? Mama, you have to learn to respect my husband and I. And for the period you will stay in this house, you should please do as I say. Okay, ma. Chop! Eh? Instruction carried. Ah! You got to check, 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 check. My, my husband this, my husband that. I can my husband every. He tell my husband when I get back to you. I'm on the phone. You know who? The only husband. Only can no one do husband. I'm not going to miss you when you know again. Husband this, husband that. Oh God, you! I just prepared me. I all no job. So I personally had to bring this myself. Um, it's um, the hard drive containing our company's financial statements for the past three months. Here, I forgot to give it to you earlier. You shouldn't have bothered driving down back here. You should have given it to someone. <laughs> you kidding me? These are very important documents. There is no way on earth I'm going to give it to just anybody. <laughs> All right, though. Yeah. Hello? Okay, let him in. Come. Hey, 
biggest boy now. So <laughs> my bad. Hey, beautiful. What's up? Don't you remember her? Oh, come on, what are you saying? How would I know such a pretty dancer and forget her face? I'm sorry, but you're not my type. Is she? <laughs> the one that I embarrassed me the other time. What's she doing here? Well, um... Well, her father owns the new company I'm about to manage their finance. So she's my business partner. Mm. Mm, business partner. I see. <clears throat> anyway, I should get back to the office. Okay? So yeah. I'll, I'll talk to you on the phone. Enjoy the rest of your day. All right. Solomon. Mm-hmm. 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 Come on, yeah. You, you're a very good guy. Do you think good agree? No trace. Mm. Come on, you know she's more than a business associate. Tell me what's happening. Listen, Solomon, I don't mix business with pleasure. And I can never cheat on my wife. I hear you, Pastor. Well done. I saw the way you're looking at her. She's looking at you, and you're looking at her again. Something is going on, man. Anyway, um, it's lunchtime. I found I'll run something with we'll chop now. So I'm going to have a lot to attend to, so I can't even step out of this office. But I can give you my ATM card, you go get the food, bring it here and eat. Yeah, why not? Come on. Hmm? Sharply. The pin is my son's birthday. Uh, one more thing. Give me your car key now, so I'll be fast, you know? Uh, so no more. So no more. I'll be fast now. Drive carefully. G boy! <coughs> Seems like she is my man. Okay, now look at look at good, alright? Okay. Alright. Come, spend wisely. Spend wisely. And I don't get a lot for this card where I give this guy. This is unbelievable. In fact, this is the perfect news I've heard today. Wait, you mean John is now a big man? John is not just a big man. John is into millions. <laughs> if you see John, if you see Ka, see office, see, see John. Jesus Christ. Oh, see, see, see. Now that God has finally remembered John, he has also remembered you. Yes. You, of course. John has remembered me. John actually offered me a managerial position in one of his many companies. I said it. He's is, is it, you know why I say John is a good person? I know that John will definitely remember you. Then look at it. But I turned it down. Yeah? Wait, Solomon, you did what? You turned the offer down? Yes. You did what? Yes, I turned it down. Why? Because I don't want to be anybody's boy. Huh? I want to be my own boss. Oh. I'm a visionary. I have passion. I have plans the way I want to live my life. Oh. Okay, okay, you tell me now. Now that you have turned this offer down and you need money to start up a business, so how would you go about it? John D now. John, come on, come on, come on. This is this is this is, this is not making sense. Why would you reject an offer simply because he, oh no 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 now guy? Ah no now doesn't make any sense. Ah. He's my man, he won't forget the past. He will give me money. I can't work for somebody else. I can't. I'm done. I'm done calling someone boss. See, if you, the business I want to go into, uh, even if you have money, if I tell you, you borrow, you lend me. If I tell you the business, you lend me money. It's a very valuable business. Yes, come in. Sorry to disturb you, but I was just mm -hmm. passing by and thought. Brought me lunch. That's very thoughtful of you. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, um, how's work going? Always so busy. 
van. Als je wel eens ziet. Please, if you want to sit, make use of the chair. You can't sit here. John, are you trying to tell me you don't feel what I feel for you? I don't feel anything for you, and I will never feel anything for you. I'm married. So respect that fact. And if you must come here, make sure it's on a business note. Please. <clears throat> Take your food, I'm no longer interested. Like that again, I beg. Ah. What are you thinking about this man till now? He is a married man. I'm trying. I'm trying, but can't you see? Fate keeps bringing us back. Hey. You're just being delusional, babe. You've told me countless times how he refused your advances. I'm bluntly told you that he does not want to mingle. And you're still forcing yourself on this man. I don't get it. I think it's just playing hard to get. <sighs> just the way I like it. You better come out of this madness. The earlier the better. Fine. He's rich. He's handsome. But the fact still remains that he is married. Read my lips, babe. Married. Stay away from this man. Look. I'll keep trying, okay? I'll try my luck. But he may just give in. People have guys that sometimes now. When they're being chased, they just, you know, try to do some more kind of shakara. Oh, sometimes. Well, I'm ready for the challenge, please. You know what, at this point, I think I'm giving up on you. I will not force you any longer. No, 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 no. Do exactly what you want to do. My hands are off it. But do not get burnt. Because, babe, you're actually playing with fire. Well, lucky for me, I am water. And this babe has quenched every damn fire. Suit yourself. Thanks, <laughs> babe. <laughs> oh, yourself, oh. Vex, Vex. Why are you not sleeping? Huh? And do this. And do that. And cook it this way. I am frustrated. I just wish you'd go back to her husband. Baby, don't forget it's your mom we're talking about. 
You have always complained that you needed a helping hand. She helps you with Junior. So why are you complaining? I know I complained about doing the whole house chores alone. But I meant somebody else, not my mother. Uh, someone that would give me listening ear and, and cooperate with me. My mother sees me as that her little girl. So, it's, it's not going to be easy with her. Because <laughs> we are like best of friends when we are far apart. But together, we are like bomb waiting to explode. Listen, I will do something about this, okay? Mm. Yes. So how are you going to do it? Trust me, I will find a way I will resolve this, okay? Now let's go to sleep. Thank you. Mr. Mats, you look so brother. fresh, my brother. Thank you. Thank you. So, how is your family? <sighs> my brother, they are fine. They are fine. They are actually disturbing to come back to the country. But I promise that when next I visit, I'll come with them. Please bring them home. I can't wait to host them with Nigerian wonderful delicacies. <laughs> I know you're going to spoil me with that. Okay? <laughs> They're my people now. Yes, so how is Junior and your wife? My wife is fine. My son is doing good. All is well. And bless God. Okay. What's going on now? What's happening in the country? You know what? Enough of this talk I talk. Come, let me take you out. <laughs> let me bore you. That's what I'm calling. <laughs> See enjoyment. Remember those days I used to come here, we just manage to drink one bottle of beer and eat Bamo and we run. <laughs> Good old days. Uh, our old crew. Now who would be this now? You know, sometimes I miss this food, sometimes I don't miss this food. I miss this food in the sense that growing through poverty, I learned a lot. But even at that, poverty is one thing I will never wish for my own. Yes. So I wouldn't like to go back to that state again. God will punish poverty. Poverty is a bastard. I see you now, I see your package, see everything. I'm very happy for you. <laughs> nah, your phone is ringing. Hello? Are you serious? See. You're living? <laughs> John, nah. hey. See us. See us money fits John. See John come fresh. Package. Ha, the big J. Ha, money is good, man. John! John! He has forgotten his phone. John! Hey. He has forgotten his phone. Anyway, he's not a rich man. He can afford to buy 10 if he wants to buy. I'll take the phone to him tomorrow. Let me drink. Let me finish even this. I'll give you the phone tomorrow. You've been avoiding me. No, you have been mad at me. What are we even fighting about? Well, I don't know. One minute we're cool. The next minute everything included. Which guy? They're all casual. different people. Anyway, you can send them a message right now. No, 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 please, please, babe, babe, don't. Babe, don't. You're sounding and you're acting desperate. I have told you times to that number. Stay away from this guy. There are many single guys out there. Babe, leave person in property alone now. Eh? I'm not listening to you. But I just sent him a message saying. I want to. 
Because how long can you be? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god. <laughs> Are you sure he's not like Zukiah? He said, meet me up at the Valley's Hotel. <laughs> what did you just say? Hater. That's what you can say now, right? I'm only looking out for you, nothing more. Because I can see when it comes to this guy, your senses just fly out of the window. Ada, you need to relax. Don't tell me you're going there now. Like hell I am. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on. What if this is a trap? See, I'm feeling for you here. What if this is what that is replying you? <sighs> I can't hear you. I'm gonna go dress up. By this time of the night. Anna, I do not care. <laughs> My dreams are coming true. Augusta, <laughs> Augusta, come on. Why is she so desperate for heaven's sake? What do I do? Hmm. <laughs> Hello. Hello. I'm so happy. I mean, we have a little privacy right now. But I told you I will handle that. So tell me, how did you manage to convince Mama to go? And, oh, darling, you needed to have seen her when she was living. She was so happy and even singing your praises. <laughs> Listen, hon, how I did that does not matter. The most important thing is that you now have your house back to yourself. Yes, baby. Thank you. You're welcome. Mm. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm, I'm washing out, okay? By this time of the night? Yes, I got an emergency call from the friend. But trust me, before you know it, I'm back. Hmm. Okay. But well, please come back as soon as possible. Of course, nobody will leave a beautiful man like you and wasting time outside. Mm. See you right. soon, eh? See you soon. Alright, darling. Bye. Bye. Be careful. Love you. Love you too. <laughs> this is the face of the bastard. That the must have raped and let my friend to die. You have met your end today. Can you just calm down? I'm sure you people are the wrong ones. Because I know absolutely nothing about what you say. Lies! Officer, he's lying! You want to deny you don't know Augusta Jack? Eh? I know Augusta Jack. She's my business partner. Okay. So, what's the problem? Please arrest this guy! Arrest him! Arrest me for what now? Listen, I, I don't know what you're talking about. I have no reason to work anybody. I'm a responsible young man and married than that. So you have to pull off to the station for further questioning and interrogation. And you have to remain silent because anything you say or do here will be used against you in the court of law. Mm -hmm. I can follow you guys to the station because fear conscience fears the accusation. But please, can I call my wife? No, that is not possible. You have to pull off to the station. Let me call my wife. Officer, I hate this man! Come, come, come. Move. Please, other than Wait, sir. Okay. Rapist! Rapist! You made your end today! What have you said, I'm allowed to you too! Okay. I don't really know. I don't really know. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. What just happened? I don't really know. Actually, I was here. A lady came with some policemen and took her guy away. On what ground? What did they do? I'm confused. I don't just know. I, she was inside screaming on top of her voice. Uh, rapist, rapist, rapist. So, it was... What? How is that possible? Or oh, that is not a type of person. Hmm, my brother, 
Only vouch for a child in your stomach. Child? Things happen these days. Wow. You don't want to be trusted. Things happen. Excuse me. Please, I need to talk to my wife. Can I make use of your phone? Let's talk about this, your wife. Let's talk about this, your wife. I'll take phone. Let me call her now. Since then, you won't call her now. Thank you. You know the color that These scammers, they will call you and wait for you to talk first. Nonsense and jobless people. Can you stop buzzing my phone? Baby. What? Where, 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 where? where? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. No, 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 God. What is this again? Hello? Hello, Mr. Nathan. My husband has been arrested. I, I, I don't know what happened. Okay, please. Let, let's meet at the usual place. I'm coming right away, right now. Ten minutes. It's fine. It's fine. Thank you. Thank you. I'm coming. My husband. Wait, please. Uh, just silver. Hey, what do you mean by he's a rapist? I want him out of this place now. Yes. Okay, that man is not going anywhere. He's a rapist. Why are you calling him a rapist? What claims do you have to call him a rapist? Why are you holding him back here? Look, I must leave this place with my brother. Yes. He must live here with yes. his family. And if you need him, he will still appear here. Please. If you don't want to attend to me, you are being with Let me see your boss. I'm coming. It's okay. It's okay. Everything will be fine. Hey. Are you sure? It'll be fine. Just, just relax, okay? What sort of life is this? I mean, how can this thing be happening now that this boy's life has totally changed? I, I, I couldn't believe it at first. This whole thing sounded like a dream. Um, um, Solomon, if I should understand you clearly, you said you don't believe it at first. That means it has finally turned out to be true. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> what, what, what do I believe? What, what do I know? The, all fingers kind of pointed at him. You know, you, you know when some things happen now, you just like... I'm going to leave all these uh, accusing fingers. Forget the evidence. This is Nigeria. You understand? see, what I believe is that somebody is behind this. Yes. But look at it this way. Somebody can easily set this guy up just to get everything he has. Uh, Jude, 
Do not forget that there's no one that knows John more than I do. So if I'm telling you, it seems like he's guilty. Trust me. I know what I'm saying. You know, I've heard from her. I've heard from, you know, it's, it's somehow, it's like, it's like there's something he's not telling me. You know? And see, eh, there's a way he looks at the girl all the time. This time, you see, you, you, you know when someone really wants to, you know how it is now. I keep suspecting that. Well, um, um, my brother, I, I, I don't know. I'm not convinced. You understand, but I just believe that there's something wrong. Something is just not right. Yes, something is certainly not right. My love, you're not sleeping. How can I sleep when such allegation is heaped on me? My love, my heart is heavy. I can't sleep. Like you said, it's just a mere accusation without any proof. Even at that, I can't sleep. I was embarrassed at the office today. I was accused of rape. Rape, my love, rape. Look, I am sure there's a mix-up somewhere. Do not sweat over it. Don't worry. We will go to the police station and do whatever we have to. My husband, please do not allow this eat you up. I am here for you. I know you didn't do it. I want you to understand that. I love you so much. And it is still that to us part. Thank you very much. This means a lot to me. my office. Why is my office locked? Where is this coming from? Have you suddenly gone deaf? Where is this coming from?
that bastard. That bastard in sheep clothing. I'll make sure he pays for it. I was expecting more from him. How could he? Gosh. Oh! I never knew John was this wicked. <laughs> he drugged me. I can see the effect. I've been with you since it's all started. How can, how can a man be so heartless, wicked and dirty? John Silver will pay for this. I'll make sure he pays for everything he has done to you. Don't worry. I believe you're coming back for checkup tomorrow, right? It's fine. I'll still come and pick you up, okay? Don't worry. Everything will be fine. That man, he'll pay for it. The silver. Babe, calm down. All right? My love, how do you expect me to calm down? When I'm being accused of rape, Rape. That's a dent on my image. I have been suspended from work. My business associates are terminating our contracts. My life is messed up already. I can't calm down. Mm -hmm. I see that. Don't worry. We will work this out. But why is this happening now? After all we've been through, why now? Where is this coming from? Why, why now? I'm being accused of something I know nothing about.
okay. It's okay. It's just a dream. It's okay. 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 It's just a dream. It's okay. Calm down. Mr. Matt, thank God you are here. Please sit. Uh, your wife called me. Yes. Just like I said, your wife called me. I think we should go to the police station. But they've not invited us. So why go there? That's the point. Why do we have to wait for them to invite us? We are trying to prove that you are innocent. So, if we have nothing to hide, why wait? <sighs> I think you're right. Let's go to the police. Maybe take care of Junior, okay? We will be right back. No, no, no. I am coming with you, Matt. What do you mean? Because I'm coming. Let me make sure he's safe. I did not rape Miss Augusta. Then where were you on the 15th of October between the hours of 10 p.m. and 2 a.m.? I was... I was at home with my wife. Are you sure? If then, why do you have to think about it? Because you are sitting before me and asking me silly questions. I'm not in questions. Hey, hey, relax. I am here to help you. Just calm down and help yourself. But I'm innocent. The calmness in my voice should tell you that I have nothing. I have no hand in what happened. Believe me, officer. I'm innocent. I did not train Miss Augusta. I've known Johnson for up to a year. But I can assure you that there is a miss of something. Did 
Mr. John A.K. No Augusta Jack. My husband has never cheated on me. Tagoro, baby, no one. My husband has never been violent. Even times when I had previously pushed him past his limits, he never hurt me. Officer, I promise you, there's a mix up somewhere in his innocence. My husband would never do anything like that. He did it. I witnessed all the calls and messages. He whipped my friend and left her to work. <laughs> they met some time ago in a bar before they became business associates. She knew him. And she became so obsessed with him. I tried to warn her, but she refused. She kept on flowing around him like a dog. <laughs> Judging from their characters, she seems like a mom who will be doing the ripping, not the job. Do you recognize this? This is a red shirt. Look at the baby. He's like, you see. I don't have eye problem. It's a red shirt. I don't want to say it's blue. Doesn't this look like your shirt? Are you not familiar with this shirt? <sighs> Officer, even if this isn't a shirt, does it, does it mean I'm responsible for what happened? I'm denying my shirt or it's not a red shirt or whatever. I am not responsible for what happened. I did not mean mean some Augusta. Do you mean now? So you mean it's twice. Do you recognize this? Is this not the same shirt? Or do you want to deny your shirt again? Officer, anybody can own a red shirt. It's in the market. These cats also forgotten in the hotel room. They belong to you. These are my cats. Yes. But that doesn't mean I regret. What's funny? Am I funny? Does it look like I'm playing with you? Come on, officer. As an officer, I expect you to be friends with me. Yes. Because she found my car in the room, now I assume that I'm the one that did this. Just because my car was found there. Come on, officer. You should be different at this. Clear conscience fear is no accusation. I am not responsible. I do not. I cannot rape anyone in my life. Not because of you. It's a personal decision. I did not do this. Officer, I can swear with everything I own with my life. That girl is lying. This is a set of movies. Trust me. Trust me. Be you know, honest. Can you tell me that your husband 
did not read Miss Augusta Jack. Officer, oh, trust me. John is innocent. He cannot even hold a fly. He's a good man. He will never cheat to me. He loves me that much. Officer, please, I'm begging you, please. This is a bad <laughs> Yes. That bastard did it. John Silver whipped my girlfriend and left her to rot. I'm very sure about that. I won't be so sure about that. He's my friend. But he may have lost control. You know how it is with us men. At times we can't control much. But I know she threw herself at him. Maybe she didn't like the outcome. That's why she's starting to rape. But I tell you, it was no rape. It's not like that. All I see was two adults eating the forbidden fruit. That's what I know. That's what I think. They wouldn't do a thing like that. Just like I told you, Boots. I have known Mr. Johnson for a while right now. I can confidently tell you that he is the most noble and honest man I know on earth. He has worked himself so much to the top where he is right now. He's a loving father and a husband. I don't see any reason why he would want to jeopardize the best thing he has in life for him. Just sex. I think you as the police should investigate this matter and discover the loophole. Because it doesn't make any sense at all. Miss Augusta Jack, there are claims that you have been constantly flirting around Mr. John. In the past, yes. But what does it matter if I was flirting with him? Tell me everything that I need to know. I am. Um... I met Mr. John a year ago at a bar. I, uh, I tried to talk to him, but he said he was married, so I left him. And about two months ago, I found out he was the one managing my father's company, finances. So how was it like when you met him again? It was nothing out of the ordinary. I went into his office. I recognized him. He didn't recognize me, so I introduced myself. And then I apologized to him. Hmm. Oh, very interesting. Why did you have to apologize to him? Because I... Because I felt I, I may have harassed him. And I felt bad. So I... Um, that's why, that's why I did. But that's it, really. That's it. It's just been work between us aside that. Then what changed? It is stated in your statement that you invited him to a hotel. When we started working together, I realized I still liked him. So, um... I sent him a message that night. What was the content of the message you sent to him? <laughs> I 
I want to let I want to lick you. Oh, I want to lick you. And he invited you to a location, a hotel location, right? So what happened? I went into the hotel and then I got a message containing the room number. The door was slightly open. So I went in and I told the wife I was on the table. That's all I remember. What else? We need facts. You have to remember, we need facts. How many times did he touch you? He raped me countless times. <laughs> I, I begged. I begged and begged until I lost my voice. <laughs> when did he leave? He left when he noticed I wasn't responding anymore. I'm sure he thought I was dead. <laughs> Is there any other thing you feel I need to know? Sorry, I can't remember. Well, I understand. I understand that you were drugged. But please, in case if there is any piece of your memory that comes back and you think the information will be helpful for our investigation, don't hesitate to call me. Right? You may please go. On the 15th of October, we sent a message to Miss Augusta Jack, sending her a room number from your personal line as a reply to the message she earlier sent to you, reading, I want to meet you. Nothing like that happened. If you go through our messages, the only thing you will see here is business messages. Business messages. Business and nothing more. Is this in the phone? <laughs> Officer, believe me, I'm innocent. How come? How, how did this happen? You tell me. Tell me how it happened. Officer, listen. He shared my mind. The cards are mine. But trust me, I'm innocent. That doesn't mean I wrote her. Well, Miss Augusta confirmed that you have been the one she was talking to. That you sent her the hotel room number when she got to the location. When she got into the room, you dropped her and raped her until she fled, leaving her to die. Officer, why would I do such at my age stage? What about my understand why? Why would I do such? Why would I make so long? It doesn't make sense. What would I gain by raping someone at my age stage? It's funny. What for? I did not. I'm innocent. So, that is the question that you need to answer. Because your shirt was seen at the crime scene of the crime. Your shirt was seen at the scene of the crime. Your business card, there. To cram it all, your name was used to book the hotel room and your card, your ATM card was used and paid fully for the hotel room. I am confused as you are, officer. 
Now this is where you come in as an intelligent policeman. Investigate. Unravel this mystery. But one thing is for sure, I am innocent. Believe me. It's your duty to help us solve this. You have rules, you have this, you have that, fine and good. I'm not arguing, but trust me, I'm innocent. I don't know how all this happened. That is the big question you have to ask yourself. The question is why would someone go this far to flip me up? Hey, the big J, my guy. <laughs> Welcome, man. <laughs> the big J. Thanks for your support. I really appreciate. What are friends for? Look at there. I'm there for you. Alright, man. Welcome, huh? Can I see your son? Where were you? What, what are you talking about? Where were you as at the time of that raid that night? Where were you? Annabelle. You told them you were home, but you were not home. Can you just tell me the truth? And don't, nothing but the truth. Don't tell me you are believing all this. Are you beginning to believe all this? I am not. But I have been standing by you since this whole thing started. I deserve to know the truth. Open up to me. Explain to me. Annabelle, trust me. I have no hand in this. I'm your husband. Believe me, I have no hand in this. John, where were you at the time of that rape? Where were you? This is not the right time to throw tantrums. I will explain later. I need explanations now. Hello. I think, Mr. John, your time is up. Stand for long, so he'll be here early. Maybe they're stuck in the traffic now, eh? Um, okay, you know what? Not to worry, let me go get us a cab, okay? Can you stay if I need for some minutes? Of course, I want you to take me for. I'm still that strong, Augusta, you know. It's fine, I know you're strong, but I'm just pitying you, my darling. All right, just stay, don't move. I'll be right back, okay? Let me get us a cab. Hello, Augusta. How are you? So, I, what do you want from me? I understand. I know. Relax, me. relax. I see here. Eh? I'm so very sorry about what my friend did to you. I, I didn't know he was such a monster. 
Honestly, how can a man, how can the heart of a man be this evil? Why would a man do such a thing to a pretty lady like you? Yeah? Uh, sorry, okay? Uh, please, can I, can I drop you at home? Let me drop you at home. Come, let me drop you. I can find my own way, way home. No, come on, let me drop you. I can find you. my way home, please. Thank you. God will punish him, oh. Hey, God will punish him. I can't even be this wicked. I can't even be this heartless. Hope you didn't hurt yourself. Huh? Did you hurt yourself? Sorry, okay? Sorry. Huh? So my, my car is outside. Let, let me drop you. Wait, I'm sorry, I couldn't get a car. Eh? That's I... fine. What do we do now? It's okay. So let me take us home. Are you sure about that? We don't have a choice now, do we? Yes, yeah, so right, I'll, I'll, drop, I'll drop you girls, huh? All right, thank you uh, so much. Let's assist her, okay? Thank you. Yeah? Keep sorry, eh? How can a man be this wicked? Do you know, I, do you know I didn't know men can do this? So, no, no, no. So sorry. sorry. Please, where is your car parked? It's parked that side, huh? Okay, so sorry, that huh? It's parked sorry. that side. Sorry, yeah? Sorry, yeah? Huh? Sorry. I don't know why there's a car everywhere. I, I searched everywhere. No, no, I'll drop you girls. Sorry. I'll drop you girls. Sorry, yeah? An illusion. Everybody is running into conclusion. The question I'm asking is who is the enemy and who they die of fame? Ah, Somebody tell me this is all a dream. Nah, cause this is more than how simple it seems. Oh, I know that people are talking outside, tongues are wagging, only God knows I am innocent, but who is walking to bring me down, hey, but there's not temptation, uh, with a little girl. My sister, you're welcome. How are you doing today, Mr. John? How am I supposed to be doing? Everything was moving on fire until the world crashed. So how am I supposed to do it? Well, Mr. John, I clearly understand your plight and that is why I'm here to help you. All I need is a cooperation. Firstly, let me introduce myself. I am Barrister Rosely M. A.K. And I'm going to be your lawyer. Um, your friend here has told me a lot about your case, but I will be needing to ask you some personal questions.
Where were you on October 5th? Mr. John, there are so many loopholes and we need to fill in the gap as soon as possible. We need to know why your shirts, ATM and your business card was there. I don't know how they all got there. I don't know how they all got there. I don't know. I don't know how they all got there. All I know is that I'm innocent. I did not feel anybody. I cannot feel I am innocent. Thank you so much for talking to me. I don't mention it's the least I could do after what happened. It's okay. Stop apologizing. After all, you're not the one who raped me. Babes, I have to rush now. Let me go get some fuel for the chain. Aww. You're literally the sweetest person right now. Oh. <sighs> Thank you for everything, babe. You well, see, my has been treating me like a baby since the accident. She's I'm getting better. Almost decided. Can I go now? <laughs> Not at all. Alright, guys, see you guys. Uh, I guess I'll take my leave too. Oh, please, please. 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 It's fine. I'm getting better already. I know that. <laughs> so, Mr. John, where were you within the time? 10 p.m. to 5 p.m. A friend of mine called me around 10 p.m. And who is that your friend? So, Solomon, he called me around 10 p.m. on that of you. Okay, that's Thank you for giving me company. No, no, no. I should be taking you for granted my privilege to spend quality time with such a pretty time, so like you. <laughs> um, Excuse me, I have to pick up my call. Please make yourself comfortable, okay? okay. I'm, I'm so sorry. It's so hot in here. I'm sorry. It's okay, it's okay. I'm not complaining. I'm fine, provided I can spend all this time with you. Excuse me. Is it not? Yeah. Uh, it is. <laughs> Stop! 
told anyone this story because I felt it's not necessary. <clears throat> On that ugly night around 10 p.m. Solomon called me and asked that I need to know something. I rushed out. When I got there I realized Solomon was coming with us to chill with a few bottles of drink. We chilled over a few drinks. Along the line, he asked me to worry in my car so that he can go pick one of his babes, which I did. Solomon being Solomon, he did not return help. So I took a car home. And when I got home, I crashed into my bed without even checking what the time was. I don't understand, John. Why did you not say anything about this earlier? Because it's not necessary. And what if? Solomon is the one that committed the crime. Come on, don't say that. Solomon will never do such. How? Okay, Solomon read her. Solomon read her and paid her to accuse me. I don't get it. How? Well, Mr. John, never say never. What's the matter with you? Huh? Why are you shaking? Nothing. Um, I, I think it's just uh, taken a bit too long after. Let me, um, just give me just one minute. Let me, let me, let me. Relax. Relax. Are you in there to try to say you're not enjoying my company? <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> Certainly not. Um. I'm um I'm enjoying every every minute of our um, conversation. It's just I am uh, I, I need to take my drugs. Let me, let, me, let me get water. I'm, I'm just um, just get a glass of water. Though. Let me take my drugs. Technically, 
which was supposed to be John. You were so wicked! You were the devil! I hate you! Really? I am not. I just wanted to love you. John lost his father. I was about to return it. Then I couldn't help but read your numerous love messages to you. They called me jealous. You had basically thrown yourself at him, but you wouldn't look at me. And no one is answering me. Hey! I think those are the last person that saw me. If you try this, do me all up and kill you! You are a beast! No! Was your most guy still packed outside now? I will be seeing Inspector Adams now and I will get back to you shortly. As promised. Uh, I need to ask a few questions and do some investigations on my own. I mean, I need to know because we have some broken pieces here that need to, you know, need to be solved. Thank you very much. Thank you. Um, that's true. Thank you, Barry for your time. I really appreciate it. Okay. I will have to go now. I'll be back shortly. Thank you. Okay. Everything will be fine. I trust her. I hope so. By the way, where is my wife? She was supposed to come here with you people. I... I don't know. When I got to your house, she wasn't there. I felt she was all... And we here with you. Listen, Martha. Abandon whatever you have done. And make sure my wife and I will be fine. It's alright. I will. I will. Okay? And more importantly, I want you to put yourself together. Put yourself together and be strong. Okay? Remember, at the end of the tunnel, there is always light. And we are close to that light right now. Okay? Let me go check out the light.
trying to say? John, call the police! Call the police! Call, call, call them! John, what happened? John, they do it! This is all the money. What? Augusta, you're scaring me. What's going on now? Talk to me. Hey, go. What's happening? You're even knocking the door. Baby, you're scaring me. Please, please talk to me. Please talk to me. What's going on? Come on, come on. I'll drive. Let's go. Let's go. You can't drive. It's okay. Babe, where are we even going to? Easy, easy. Jesus. What's going on? Easy. Once again, Mr. John, we are deeply sorry for the mix-up. We are not entirely to be blamed. As you can see, the culprit is so close to you. Hence, a clean job. And the evidence was so concrete that no one can doubt it. We are deeply sorry. Just find the place you have to forgive me, please. Hmm? Uh, John, please, please, uh, find a place you have to forgive me. So I personally had to bring this myself. Um, it's um, the hard drive containing our company's financial statements for the past three months. Here, I forgot to give it to you earlier. You shouldn't have bothered driving down back here. You should have given it to someone. <laughs> you kidding me? <laughs> These are very important documents. There is no way on earth I'm going to give it to just anybody. <laughs> You're right, girl. Yeah. Hello? Okay, let him in. Come. Biggest boy now. Hey, beautiful. What's up? Don't you remember her? Oh, come on, what are you saying? How would I know such a pretty dancer and forget her face? I'm sorry, but you're not my type. Is she? The one that embarrassed me the other time. What's she doing here? Well, um, well, her father owns the new company I'm about to manage their finance. So she's my business partner. Mm. Mm, business partner. I see. <clears throat> anyway, I should get back to the office, okay? So yeah. I'll, I'll talk to you on the phone. Enjoy the rest of your day. All right. Solomon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, come on, yeah. You know, you're a very good guy. Do you your thing, good degree. No trace. Mm -hmm. Come on, man. You know she's more than a business associate. Tell me what's happening. Listen, Solomon, I don't mix business with pleasure. And I can never cheat on my wife. I hear you, Pastor. Well done. I saw the way you're looking at her. She's looking at you, and you're looking at her again. Something is going on, man. Anyway. Um, it's lunch time. I found I run something with good chop now. So I'm gonna have a lot to attend to, so I can't even step out of this office. But I can give you my ATM card, you go get the food, bring it here and eat. Yeah, why not? Come on. Hmm? Shopping. The pin is my son's birthday. Uh one more thing. <laughs> give me your car key, so I'll be fast, you know? Uh, so long. So no more. I'll be fast now. Drive carefully. Gee, boy! <coughs> Seems like she is my man. Okay, now look at look at go now, huh? Okay. Alright. Come, spend wisely. Spend wisely. And I don't get a lot for this card where I give this guy. Enjoyment. Remember those days that we used to come here, we just manage drink one bottle of beer and eat Bamo and we run. <laughs> Good old days. Uh, like our old crew. <laughs> now, who would be this now? You know, sometimes I miss this food, sometimes I don't miss this food. I miss this food in the sense that 
growing through poverty, I learned a lot. But even at that, poverty is one thing I would never wish for my enemy. Yes. So I would like to go back to that state again. Yes. God will punish poverty. Poverty is a bad start. Yes. See you now. See your package. See everything. I'm very happy for you. <laughs> nah, your phone is ringing. Hello? Hello? Are you serious? Mm -hmm. You are living? <laughs> yes. Hey, John. Hey. See us. See us money fit, John. See us, John, come fresh. Package. Ha, the big J. Ha, money is good, man. John. John. He has forgotten his phone. John. Hey. He has forgotten his phone. Anyway, he's not a rich man. He can afford to buy 10 if he wants to buy. I'll take the phone to him tomorrow. Let me drink. Let me finish even his own. Let me drink. I'll give you the phone tomorrow. She's not calling you. This John, eh? you forgot your phone. He has not come back to take it, not even try to reach me. He's calling you. Test message. From August. I want you to come and lick me. Kai! Oh God! I wish it was me. Hmm? I wish it was me. I don't understand this boy. Such a pretty damn cell. We'll be throwing herself all over him. And he refuses to accept her.
trabalho legal, em frente. Pode ser. Pode ser. Pode ser. Pode ser. The devil's hand will work. I didn't know what I was doing. Please, Annabelle, please. He's begging for me. Why don't you come in? Are you all right? Take it easy. 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 I swear, I, I had no idea it wasn't you. Guess what? What? I bought this for you. Really? Yes. Oh, my sweet man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. 
All this for me. All this for you. Thank you so much. So where is Junior? He's upstairs. Upstairs. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. I love you. <laughs> 